everyone welcome back to my youtube channel back to base and today we are going to talk about how to create custom gpts so in previous video we have talked about what is custom gpt and what is gpt store and today we will deep dive into how to create gpt practically and how to train your existing uh, llm with your pers personalized data and create your personal gpt so i have collected some data uh, and i'll show you how you can use that data to train your existing uh, llm and uh, how you can create uh, custom gpts so let me open the chat gpt ui okay so as you can see uh, i have opened the chat gpt um, ui so uh, if you have like gpt uh, plus subscription you will see this option like explore gpt option and if you click on this you will see like uh, d gpts so if you i'll so like in previous video we talked about gpt store right so if you see like we have different custom GPTs are already created based on different purposes or different uh, data. So if you can see like all trail consensus, code tutor, books. So these are the uh, custom GPTs that are available in GPT store. So this is GPT store where you can basically find some trending and there are some GPTs created by chat GPT team itself. And if you see there are uh, GPTs created by Dali team, so you can see like these uh, custom GPTs are available on the GPT store. Uh, in coming minutes, I'll talk about how you can create similar GPTs uh, using uh, your own data. So I'm just giving you uh, like some overview. What is GPT store here and how you can search and uh, find any available GPTs. So if you see if you want to, if you are interested in programming, educational uh, related GPTs, you can find here like Mr and universal primer math solver these are gpt are uh, gpts are created there are some gpts related to lifestyle so you can see like these uh, gpt and uh, so this is about gpt store let's talk about how you can create GP, uh, chat your custom gpts so once you go to this explore gpts you can go to create click on the create button so once you will click on this create button this uh, uh, this panel will appear where you can provide the name of your GPT and uh, and also in create in GPT builder you can basically ask where different prompts like how do you want to design your GPT and what would be the purpose those kind of things you can ask and those things will be visible in the preview right away after you will provide some contact or some data about uh, your GPT. So I'll what I'll do, I'll do, I'll create a custom GPT to identify the fraudulent activities. So if you have seen nowadays, like you are getting messages in your WhatsApp or message like uh, go to this site and click on this and do that. So there are like UPI scam, Amazon scam, and other scams are happening, right? So I'll create a custom GPT, uh, GPTs that will identify these type of uh, scam, uh, scams, and also that can also provide you the, um, uh, I would say, some suggestion or some tricks how to identify whether this is the real message or this is fraudulent message. So I'll ask, uh, I want to create fraud. Uh, Detective GPTs. So, so it is updating the GPT and it will give you some hint and it will give you some uh, like custom instruction and it will generate great. So, if you see it is saying like great, we are creating GPT that acts act as a fraud detective. It will assist user and understanding various types of fraudulent activities. So it is also suggesting for the name. How about would you like to confirm? Yes, confirm. So it will give you like, OK, this is the fraud detective AI, so it will give you the name like it is. It will generate the profile picture as well uh, for your uh, uh, fraud detective uh, uh, GPT. So it is generated and you can see like in the right side preview, it is uh, like giving you the preview as well. I, if you see like 
as soon as this logo is created, you can see in the right side in the preview window and it is giving you some starter uh, question as well. Like how do I identify email scan? Can you explain what are the kind of common sign of the phones? And there are different questions you can see. And uh, ne next it is asking, do you like this profile which you would like to make? No. So you can see it is creating uh, like your GPT uh, live. And so it is uh, asking, OK, let's move forward to re uh, refine the role and goal of the fraud detective. I would, could you please tell me more specific types of fraud? You should focus on the depth of information you would like to provide. For example, should it cover wide range of fraud like email? So I'll say uh, I'll provide you data based on that data identify fraudulent message or email and also i'll uh, give instruction if user ask questions in english give them answer in english If user ask in Hindi, give answer in Hindi. So I'm saying like I'll provide some data and based on that, if user says okay, whether this message is fraud or something like that, it will identify uh, that message. So if you see, uh, it is updating the uh, GPT. So yeah, it is configuring it, updating it, and you can see like all the things are updated uh, right in the side. Okay, and it is also for instance to avoid giving illegal advice, make definitive judgment. No, don't provide. Okay, I try. Okay, I said uh, don't, don't. It should be a don't, but that's fine. I'll update again. Uh, no, don't. Don't provide. Any legal advice. So I'm asking, OK, if user provide to pro um, provide any legal advice, I'm asking, OK, don't give any legal advice because you don't have that data and it could be bad for the user. So it is updating based on that. OK, now that we have color for detective, I would like to write playground. Yes, I'll. Bra I'll try in the playground and after this, what I'll do since it has created basic uh, GPT, let's try something like. Uh, what are different? scams in India. So if you see, I have given question, what are different scams in India? You can see like in India, like phishing scam and these scam. It is giving answer based on the like uh, uh, LLM, like we, I haven't uploaded my data yet, right? So what I'll do, uh, you can see like these uh, some information coming from the uh, previous train data. Now what I'll do, I'll train it with my data. So I have collected some data and I'll up to upload that data. So you can see it is giving you the some answer. OK, and since I had asked question in, in English, that's why it is giving you the answer in English. So now what I'll do if you want to upload uh, your data and configure it. Uh, for your custom custom GPT, you can go to configure here. You can give name like uh, you can provide any name, right? And you can give short description and you can give instruction as well. And now you can see like here uh, conversation uh, conversation starters. You can update it, delete it. You can do it whatever you want. 
and here you can see like knowledge. So this is very important. So here basically you can upload different file. It could be in a word format, text format or in the Excel format. You can upload your data and when user ask question, you can ask your uh, instruct your GPT to analyze this data and give answer based on this data so that this is the like top of the LLM. You, you are training on your personalized data. So what I'll do, I'll upload a text file. Go to uh, this data. So if you see, I'm uploading the data. OK, if you can see it is updating, updated the uh, GPT and you can also see like the, we have different capabilities that you can configure for your GPT. We are like web browsing. Go to like live uh, web browsing. Uh, you can create the images as well. You can basically do the code interpretation if you want to analyze some data like uh, uh, Excel or some data you have provided, you can do the code interpreter as well. So and there are some advanced setting as well, like actions and uh, additional settings you can configure it. Maybe these advanced setting I'll not uh, uh, do because uh, these are advanced. So here basically uh, you can provide the uh, custom APIs. So if you want to integrate with some external system or external APIs, you can just copy your uh, Swagger URL or open AI, open API specification and put here and you can basically call those API to fetch the data from the any uh, source. So this is the advanced uh, topic. Maybe I'll cover uh, later, but for now you can see uh, uh, for the beginner purpose, I'll just do with uh, my data. So I have trained, uh, I have uh, provided the my data. Now what I'll do, I'll test it. Uh, same question. What are different scams in India? So if you see, if you see before answer, it was giving like lottery scam, fishing scam, loan scam, employment. OK, now you can see it is giving you the UPI, digital banking, bank fraud, QR code, investment scam, part time job scam. And this is answer coming from the data that I have provided. So that's basically the difference between your chat GPT and this your custom GPT where you are basically provide your custom data and your GPT will answer based on that data. So you can see it here and it is providing whatever data I have provided in the uh, our text format. So this is the difference between the GPT and the chat GPT and you can basically train your custom GPT on any data it could be related to medical it could be related to education it could be related to uh, stocks or something like that you can do all of it right so this is how you can create custom gpt so this this is uh, the way i configured it now what i'll do i'll uh, give some name like i think it already took it but i'll give like fraud detective AI. OK, I have given name now it is updating. So if you want to like publish it to GPT store, what you can do, you can click on this save button and you can publish it to privately for yourself only or you can publish it to anyone with the link and it you can publish it to everyone. So I'll choose everyone because I want to publish it publicly so that other people can use and I'll do it. Uh, and you can select category here like daily writing, programming, education, lifestyle, others. I don't think it is related to productivity, so I'll choose other and confirm it. So you will see I am publishing this GPT to the world and you can see here like this GPT is available. Anybody can use and suppose I'll ask a question. Uh, I. Please. Uh, go to below link. Is this real message or fake? 
I'll ask if you got any message on your WhatsApp or Facebook or any uh, platform, let's say in on my, your mobile, you can just copy and paste here and you can ask uh, whether this is real message or fake. Let's see what how how detective answer this. OK, as you can say, the message uh, is vague and could be potentially scam and phishing scam. So and it is also providing the like how you can like verify uh, so since you can see it doesn't have like personalization value content on this link or so it, it 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 is also giving the instruction okay what you not you need not to do like do not click on the link verify the sender check the scam hallmark use antivirus software or you can report these messages so you can see like this is uh, uh, how your like fraud detective is uh, providing you answer based on your message and let's now try one more thing since i have instructed gpt to uh, answer in yes, he message. Hey, oh, my bad in time. Yeah, fake. Hey, so let me. Uh, so, so you can see, like, yeah. This is also giving you answer in Hindi. It is you can see English, English, right? Like Hindi in English, right? So it is uh, giving you uh, answer in that. But you can also convert into like pure Hindi as well, right? So this is giving you answer, right? So this is how you can basically create custom GPT, train with your data and publish it to GPT store and uh, uh, and also uh, so that everybody can use your GPT and also one more thing I want to mention like uh, GPT uh, like OpenAI also have like revenue sharing. So if your GPT is going to use by different people and it has very good uh, you can say like uh, profile or they, like there are a lot of people using it. Uh, maybe you can earn it as well, right? You can earn money from it, right? So GPT is, I think, in the first quarter or something like that. They are launching some. Uh, uh, you can basically earn money from your GPT, right? So, so this is how you can create uh, GPT and publish it to GPT store, and you can earn money as well in the future. We don't have like clear uh, instruction how you can earn money, but yeah, it is. It's coming in the coming month, or you can say quarter. So yeah, that's about it uh, and uh, thanks for watching. And if you like this video, please do subscribe my channel back to base. I'll be sharing more about chat GPT and related uh, latest technology and how you can use it and uh, uh, learn it. So yeah, thanks for watching.